Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC Phantom Weight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a Muay Thai kickboxer holding a professional record of 22 wins, five losses. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds, fighting out of Sao Paulo, Brazil, Thomas Tominhas Almeida. And now, here's his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 20 wins, 7 losses, and 1 draw. He stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Marlon Chico Vera! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. So, Dan Mergliata shares the cage. Are you ready? Are you ready? All right, so here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big-time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big-time athletes? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. A little single collar tie there. Oh, nice elbow. And that he comes knee. through with a big knee. That knee hurt him. And now he lands a combination. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh. These guys throwing early. Big leg kick land. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, just truly makes up the target. Sight to behold. Trying the flying knee there. Ooh. Oh! So just over 20 total strikes have landed. What a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Almeida gets hit by that leg kick. <laughs> Big right hook coming. It's rough. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice power there with the left hook upstairs. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, do you believe it? Another head kick lands. Got to start raising that guard or this is going to be the end of the fight. I mean, it's going to be the end of the fight. It's very surprising that he's even standing upright after taking such a bad shot. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing, Muscle. I mean, the speed as which he throws is crazy. Checks that leg kick. Come on, man, let's get that taken. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Big knee to the body. Hip tosses him down. Now we'll see if he can advance position. I mean, right into side control. Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground side. Step for step, he's big with his opponent in every transition. Five minutes in the books. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands. His opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what you, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. Take a seat. Deep breath, man. Okay, listen. I need you to be first. Let's go out there and let's put some good striking combinations together. Okay, now, see you ready. You ready? All right, here we go with round two. Big knee lands there. He got it. Oh, 
Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. And starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Back and forth we go! You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. All right, so a good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocking, he's rolling, he's slipping. He's doing a great job. Nice. Here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch landing. Well, he has got to be thrilled with this effort here tonight. There was a lot of pressure on him coming in. He has doled out a lot of damage, landed a lot of strikes, near flawless execution. Sometimes the hardest thing to do is what's expected. When you're expected to win, sometimes it's hard to live up to that expectation. He lives oh! up. He's out! He's done, he's done! What a fight! Pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent only saw it coming, and before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mugliano has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 52 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Thomas Dominguez Almeida! Well, we congratulate him on a huge knockout here tonight. He'll probably keep that smile while he's sleeping.